Shea Bear 1000 here. Today we're going to do something a little different. We're going to grow, or start growing, a bonsai tree. Never grew a bonsai tree before. I don't even think I've seen one in real life. I just always thought they were cool. Wanted one. Mentioned the monkey a couple times. She remembered that and got me one for Christmas. There's actually four in here. So, let's get into this, see what it involves. Okay guys, so this is what we're looking at here. Bonsai Bonanza, there's four trees in here. Um, now it says, the kit contains four nutrient-rich soil discs, four burlap pots with waterproof lining, four seed packets, four plant markers, instruction booklet, and trimming shears. So, seed varieties may vary due to seasonality, harvest times, and availabil availability you may receive a seed packet variety that is different from what appears on the box label. So we, we may not get this. But if we do, I think Monkey said she wanted the purple one. So I'm not sure. The Colorado blue spruce is cool and the black spruce is cool. Well, they're all cool, but um, the box is a real wooden box. Um, so I'm going to keep the box, of course. Because I will make something out of it. Not sure what. Okay, so let's set this down here. I'll slide this out. Woo! Alright. Did we get. Okay, so we got the black spruce, the Colorado blue spruce. I'm dead. Smells good. We got the flame tree. Where's the other one? And okay, we got the Brazilian rosewood. So we got everything that was on the box. Cool. Alright. So here's our seed packets. Alright, so we got those four. And it says again here seed varieties may vary but we did get what was on the box we got this help card don't forget to register your seed register my seeds go to www.shopgardenrepublic.com register to use the Q register or use the QR code to register your kit now your warranty number is oh so it's got a warranty by register registering your kit we can provide you with growing support through our grower help bot on Facebook Messenger and access to our team of experienced gardeners for troubleshooting and questions You'll also be able to join our private Garden Republic growers community. Okay, I may do that. I don't know. We'll see. Okay, so there's that. This is our book. And it's quite a book there, so don't give up. Troubleshooting. Okay, so welcome to the art of growing bonsai. Bonsai! Bonsai! Step one, pre-soak seeds. Okay, so I'm gonna read this up a little bit. Let's see, we've got, ooh, these are made out of wood too. Cool. All right, so I can put my date on here. Plant name. And you can put your date. Ah, that's cool. Okay, there's that. And these are our little trimmers. <laughs> A 
cool. All right. This is a cool little kit. I, I can't tell you what, how much it costs. I'd have to ask her or she can tell you. She's not here right now, so. Um, I Like I said, uh, I'm not sure where she got them. I think Amazon or eBay or something, but here's our burlap baggies. Okay, cool. And we got four of them. I'm gonna have Monkey do one. I'm gonna have her do her own. And I think she wants to film it too, so that's cool. And here's our discs. Four discs in here. So I'm guessing these discs just go in here. I don't know, like I said, I'll have to read up on it. This this is really cool. So let me get to reading. And then we're gonna get to planting. I'm gonna plant. I'm gonna start one. And I'll film that. I may do the other ones later, you know, off camera since it's you know they're all pretty much gonna be the same. So I'm not sure which one I wanna do yet. I like both of these. So I don't know, boy, that's a toss-up. I'll end up, I'll probably end up doing both these. Because I want, what I want to do is, I think Monkey said she wanted the purple one. And I'll plant the red one for her mom, and then I'll get one, and then Bruno will get one. So these two, one will be mine and one will be Bruno's, so it doesn't really matter. So, but this one feels like really bigger seeds. Oh, there's stuff on the back too for best results. Plant your seeds at a depth of one eighth inch. Don't over water. Remember the soil should be moist to the touch, not wet or dry. Get the right amount of sunlight. Plant seeds in a place that is naturally warm and well lit. Okay, in here, that's that's good. And plant nutrients after sprouting or transplanting to new soil. Add plant nutrients, okay. Plant seeds. Plant seeds one inch apart. Refrigerate extra seeds. Okay. So there's more than... Uh, Alright, I gotta read up on this. <laughs> and I'll be back with you because I don't know if you just plant one seed at a time or what. So... Let me read the book here. It's all step by step, and then, you know, we'll get on to planting at least one of these trees. So, okay, guys, hang tight. Okay, so I figured out what I'm going to do with the box. You actually use this box. So that's pretty cool. And the plastic in there, because we have to soak these. And then once we soak them, we squeeze them out and we put each one, one of these, in these, and then we set each one of these down in here. So this is cool. This is really, really cool. So I'm going to get ready. Monkey's on her way home from the hospital, so... So... I'm going to wait till she gets here so she can make sure which one of these she wants. And then we'll continue on. we got to soak the seeds. So we won't be able to plant the seeds till tomorrow. But for you guys, you know, it'll be in this video. But I'll show you how we're going to soak the seeds. And we're going to soak the uh, our little discs here. So pretty cool so hang around guys there's more to come uh, this is uh, it's gonna be a lot of fun so what they want you to do is put four or five seeds in and then save the rest in case those don't germinate but whoa 
but yeah we got to soak these so that's pretty cool all right guys I made a mess I gotta clean that up real quick so I'll be back with you monkey will be here and we'll go from there so hang tight okay guys we got our water ready so we got monkey over here monkey chose this one so monkey I was right you gotta get four of these seeds out of here how do you do that here Okay. Just put it in a spoon. Okay. This is flame tree. This is going to be mom's. I can go ahead and get them out because they're huge. How many I need? Four. put moms these four in here that's the flame tree so we're gonna put this here and we got I need those four and those ones can go back okay so, yeah. all right all right now put them in one put them in here whichever one you want here we go and they got to soak for 24 hours, now 16 grow. to 24 hours. Here's your thing. We'll put it here. Grow for me. Now, I got to get, look at these ones. How big are those? Oh. Tiny, tiny. Yeah, they are. Okay, so this one is the black spruce, black which spruce. is mine. Yours black spruce. One, two, three, four, five. You can do five. Three to five, it says. So, this is mine. This is the black spruce. God, they're so tiny. This is the bear. And then this one will be, I hope that's not a seed in there. There we go. Okay. And, and they want you to put these in a Ziploc baggie and put them in the fridge in case we need them. Now, separate them or do you just put them in one baggie? Put them in one baggie. It's fine. Okay. Now this one is the Colorado Blue Spruce. Colorado. Um, which is Bruno's. Bruno boy. Always the last one. Yep. Okay, now here's Bruno's. Now, if somebody don't come over and switch these around, we'll be good. Don't do it. So now we gotta wait all night long and then these, this is our our little soil things mm -hmm. again that we'll have to soak them tomorrow, but they they don't have to soak all night. <coughs> they just gotta soak up the water and then you take them and you squeeze the excess out and we'll put it in our burlap in our burlap baggies here. They're so cute. And then we'll put our seeds in there and then cover them up and then we'll wait. So these have to germinate. Look how big your mom's is. Yeah, they're huge. Mm -hmm. So I figured since I got four trees, we can each have one. So, cause I like to share. So, all right guys. Well, it's gonna be a long time for me, but I will, there's still two seeds left here. Okay, and that one. I'll put these away. I'll see you guys tomorrow, but for you, it'll be instantaneously. So, oh. Monkey swimming ring. So, stick around, guys. Okay, guys, it's the next day. Now we're going to take our little pucks here, our discs, they call it. We're going to put them in here. We've got two cups of warm water here, about 120 degrees, the same as what they said for the seeds. So, I got two cups of water here. Um, what it is is they average the like you know a half a cup per disc uh, some people will do each disc individually and do three quarters of a cup and I'm going to do it the way the book says they said to put it in there and it should double in size once it starts soaking it up I don't know how long it'll take it doesn't say that's another thing. It doesn't say how long you got to wait or anything like that. I 
it just says it that they'll double in size now you don't want them wet you just want them moist that's not quite two two cups but I'm gonna let these soak up I can see down there at the bottom it's it's soaking it up pretty good so hopefully you don't have to wait all night because it doesn't say it doesn't say how long you soak it I went online nobody will really gives me an answer the soil discs included in your kit expand to several times so several times their original size and when soaked in water this will be the starter soil for your pots place the disc the soil disc in a large bowl pour two cups of warm filtered water that's another thing you want to use filtered water which I did uh, And they want it warm, about 120 degrees, which I did that. I actually used used my thing here for the seeds and the soil because I don't want to, you know, I want to do everything they they say to do and pour it directly over the soil discs. Add more water as necessary, but do not oversaturate the. Oh, look at them! Well, they're growing as we're speaking. <laughs> cool. All right. Well. <laughs> oh yeah. Okay. Whoa. Okay. All right. It's like there's they're coming apart right in the middle, but that's okay. Um. So I'm gonna use the rest of this. And when we get ready to put them in our things over here and put our seeds in, I'll kick you back on. I got to change my battery anyway. I didn't charge it last night. So so what this is going to be, it's going to be its own playlist under bonsai trees or something like that. And like once a week, I'll do an update on it. Or if we have to do some trimming. I think it says in a few days we got to do some trimming. You know, I'll bring you back on for that. But. All right. Cool. <coughs> Excuse me. So. I'm going to let that soak up some more. <coughs> I'm going to change my battery. I'll be right back with you. Excuse me. Sorry for the coughing. Okay. So we're just about ready. I, I did add a little bit more water to them. So it says to break this up, crumble this up in here, squeeze out any excess. I have already done that. And then it says to crumble this up. Whoops. I was trying to do this without making a mess. I'll show you one. There will be plenty of soil here. And then they want you to put an eighth of an inch of soil loosely on top of it. So you want to save some of this. But I'll show you again just one and then I'll do the rest off camera because it's they'll all pretty much be the same thing okay so now let's see let's do let's do Bruno's we'll make this one Bruno's all right now I just got a spoon here I'm just going to see some of these seeds floated and some of them sank um So, darn it. 
pour some of this out. There we go. There they are. So there's Bruno's. So now we're going to take some more of this soil. It's about an eighth of an inch loosely on top, so. And then you want to keep this in a warm, sunny area. It says if you don't have a warm spot, you can put a, they got little heaters on, that you can put under these things. Okay, so. All right, so that's about probably an eighth of an inch. We'll give it a little bit more water here. Not much. Okay, so I'm gonna do that with the rest of them and then I'll be back with you and that'll probably be pretty much the end of this, this video. So let me get these done. Okay guys, now we wait. So, this one is Bruno's. It's the Colorado Blue Spruce. This one's Mom's. It's the Flame Tree. I'm gonna save this. I got some soil left over. I'm gonna save in case I gotta do this again. This one is mine. It is the uh, the Black Spruce, and this one's Monkeys, and it is the Brazilian Rosewood. That's gonna be pretty. So, all right, guys. Well, thanks for watching. I'll give you an update in a couple days, see how these things are doing. And let me see. Yeah, once we do that, we sow our seeds, cover the seeds with about an eighth of an inch soil. The Brazilian rosewood and the flame tree, which is that one and this one. <coughs> Our tropical trees that require a soil temperature of 85 degrees. If you don't want to purchase a heating mat and the weather is below 85, you can also uh, try placing pots in a warm car or on a heating register until germination. Placing each pot in a Ziploc bag will retain heat and moisture to help achieve the desired environment for germination okay so I might do that because it, it, it did get down to 39 last night of course not in here but uh, once the seeds germinate and reach a few inches in height place in direct sunlight for six to eight hours a day and we're in Florida that shouldn't be much of an issue so it doesn't say it doesn't say much about how long it'll take so we're just going to give it some time like I said I may I may put this one and that this one and that one in a in a plastic bag we'll see uh, I think it's gonna be alright because we'll set it over there by that window where the Sun comes in it should be fine and if it doesn't doesn't feel that warm then I will put a baggie over it. but anyway guys there we go I'll let you know in a couple days well as soon as something sprouts I'll let you know and if I have like two that sprout and two that don't I'm going to do the two that don't again since I have extra seeds but we'll just have to see so thanks for watching guys Shea Bear the Myth the Man Legend stay tuned for more on this it'll be in its own playlist of bonsai trees we'll see you in the next one bye bye guys and take care Okay, so 